Hi. So your child has been injured. You have rushed the child to the emergency department and the doctor has administered primary wound care. Your next question and quite rightly so is does my child require a tetanus shot? Tetanus is a very dangerous disease and if not detected or treated early can easily cause death and even if it doesn't cause death can cause serious disability and prolonged hospitalization the good news is that it is eminently preventable and thanks to the efforts of the government on the universal health immunization most of the population has already received the primary immunization schedule and are protected against tetanus what is not common is that people forget to give the booster doses in childhood two booster doses are required one anywhere between 15 and 18 months of age and the second booster is given anywhere between 4 and 6 years of age the adolescent requires another booster dose between 11 and 17 years of age the actual tetanus containing vaccine is slightly different and this difference is primarily for healthcare professionals and you as a parent need not know the details about it after that booster in adolescence you need one booster dose every 10 years and this is where we all slip up because we are so careful about taking care of our kids that we forget to take care of ourselves adults need immunization too now coming back to the question does your child require a shot of tetanus after his injury well it depends on three factors one is whether his primary immunization schedule is complete two when has he re- received the last shot of tetanus containing vaccine is it within 5 years is it within 10 years or is it more than that and the last is it depends upon the type of wound is it a clean wound or is it a contaminated wound is it a minor wound or is it something more than that the schedule of immunization is different for each of these categories and without getting into the nitty gritty i would like to emphasize that if your child is up to the immunization schedule in all likelihood for almost all injuries the child will not require any booster dose at the time of injury there are of course badly contaminated wounds where you may even need to give antibodies directly into the wound that is possible too but most children just require simple and good wound care and yes that includes injuries due to getting hurt with a rusty nail or falling onto the muddy ground if you like the video please do not forget to hit the like button if you are new to our channel remember to subscribe and not only subscribe hit the notification button that way you will be notified of any new video that we produce suggestions comments and criticisms are more than welcome